today we are going to learn about solids and liquids. Solid and liquid are states of matter. Matter is anything that takes up space. Now, matter comes in different states or forms. There's solid, there's liquid, and there's gas. Today, we are focusing on solids and liquids and how to classify them. We're going to start with solids. Matter is a solid when it has its own shape. Let's show you. So here are some examples of solids. Remember, matter is a solid when it has its own shape. Here is a coat. A coat is an example of a solid. It has its own shape. It's an interesting shape. It's the shape of a coat, but it has its own shape. It's a solid. Here's another one. Here's a laptop computer. It's an example of a solid. It has its own shape. It has its own shape. It's a solid piece of matter. Here's another solid, a scooter. An electric scooter that looks really awesome and fun to ride. Anyway. It's a solid, right? It has its own shape. It's a solid. Oh, I love making these. A paper airplane is an example of a solid. It is matter that has its own shape. It's a solid. Matter is a solid when it has its own shape. Now let's learn about liquids. Matter is a liquid when it takes the shape of its container. Here's some examples of liquids. Our first is water, and notice how we had to have it in a bottle in this picture because it doesn't have its own shape. It takes the shape of its container because water is a liquid. Here's another liquid, honey. Honey takes the shape of its container. It's not solid, it's liquid. It takes the shape of its container. It doesn't have its own shape. It's a liquid. Here's the last example of a liquid. It's coffee and it's in this cup. It's taking the shape of the cup because it's a liquid, it doesn't have a shape. Matter is a liquid when it takes the shape of its container. All right, so solids have their own shape and liquids take the shape of their container. All right, I think you're ready. I think you're ready to handle this. We're gonna play a quick game and figure out if these items are solid or liquid. So I hope you'll help me out. I hope you'll participate because we need to figure this out. Our first one, juice, solid or liquid? Yeah, juice is a liquid. It takes the shape of its container. How about this? A cup. Is a cup solid or liquid? Yeah, it's solid. It has its own shape. Let's try milk. Is milk a liquid or solid? Yeah, milk is a liquid. It takes the shape of its container. How about this one? Honey. Is honey a liquid or a solid? Yeah, it's a liquid. It takes the shape of its container. Let's try a car. Is a car a solid or a liquid? Is it a liquid or a solid? It's a solid. It has its own shape. Great job. 
How about shampoo? Is shampoo a solid or a liquid? Uh-huh. Shampoo is a liquid. It takes the shape of its container. Solids have their own shape. Liquids take the shape of their container. Okay, that was pretty cool. You seem to know a lot about solids and liquids now. So the next time you're drinking something or you're holding something, you can say to yourself, I know what this is.